I am with Evan Joswak from Wilson, who just won the Berks County Boys Golf Tournament. Congratulations, Evan. How do you feel? Thank you. Um, I'm, I'm really proud of myself. I, I performed under the pressure that was put on today, especially by my teammate, Jared Foltz. Um, so I, I couldn't ask for anything better to happen today. I played really well in the first 18. I came out into the second 18 expecting something big to happen between us. We ended up tying, going into a playoff hole, and that's where magic happened. Let's go back to the first 18 holes. That was the team part of the tournament, and your, your Bulldog team won. Uh, you beat Exeter by five strokes. Talk to me about the importance of winning initially as the team. Yeah, so I, I think it, it was send a really good mes message for us because we knew coming into this, it was going to be a tough competition and Exeter was going to be there and try and beat us. So I think me and Jared really set our feet firm in getting our slow, low scores. And uh, I honestly was a little disappointed with our three and fours because I know they have more potential than what they showed today. But all that matters is, is we outright beat them. Well, this morning you shot a, a 73 for the first 18 holes. You, again, your team won the championship. So your team advances to the district championship. Mm -hmm. you, you did that last year as well. You're the defending district champion. So you have something to live for there. Now let's talk about um, the, back, the back nine holes. Yes. All right, the last nine for the individual championship. You went into it with a one stroke lead, played 10 to 18. On 10, you birdied. Now you're up two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so from there, I. I really was starting to feel the pressure that I knew I had. I had a little bit of more of a lead, and I you actually felt more started, pressure with the lead. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I actually kind of fell from there with three consecutive bogeys. Right. And after 13, it was a tie. Yeah. So so there, I think Jared really really found that I was falling slowly, and he set his foot on the pedal and really really went after me, and he ended up getting two strokes, I believe. I've watched the two of you play a couple of rounds this season and during the regular season you two are almost like best friends on the course. You talk to each other every hole. That last nine holes I don't think you two said more than five words to each other. Yeah yeah that's true. <laughs> um, so outside of this championship individually we are we're perfect for each other. We talk a lot. We like to help each other. But coming into this and knowing that we were going to be competing against each other, we uh, we really had to to s kind of step over the line and and stop talking and stop being a little bit friendly. So let's go back to that back nine. We're on 16. You're down two strokes. Your tee shot. You pull it left. You think it went in the water, didn't you? Yeah. So so that was that was a <laughs> terrible shot on my I part. I saw you drop your club. You were frustrated. I, I was very frustrated visually and mentally but it didn't go in the water yeah and so you saved it it was about 18 inches off the water and there was just enough room that i could get a stance in there quick chop at it and you know get up and down so going to 17 you're down two strokes mm -hmm. you gain a stroke on 18 or 17 coming to 18 you're down one stroke yeah so you're aware of that i'm sure yes uh is all in my head which i wish it wasn't but going into 18, I knew I had to make a move. And after seeing Jared's drive, and uh, I was thinking it was really good, um, I knew I had, to, I had to do something. Really, my approach shot was what I was looking for. And I ended up pulling my drive left into one's fairway. And I got it up on the green. And I know Jared was, Jared knew that it was on the green. and. He had to punch out and he went long so from there i was really thinking i'm like man i just turned this around <laughs> this is now going in my way right and from there he didn't make the best chip and i was really feeling it i made a great putt you did miss just a bit on the low side and I, I was still feeling it and when jared stepped up to his putt and he whacked it and it went in i was my jaw dropped. I yeah. could not believe what I just that watched. It was about a 25 footer he sank to tie, to stay tie. Yeah. Forced a tiebreaker. Yeah, and uh, me over my putt, I was shaking. I couldn't really feel my hands very much. So you had a tiebreaker hole. You played 10 again. Um, 
and you crushed it, you birdied it to, to win the, the tournament. Um, they're about to do the award ceremony. I don't want to hold you up. Evan, congratulations. Not only a Bulldogs team champion, you're the county individual champion. Congratulations. Good luck at districts. Thank you.